Hey, welcome back to the channel. Today we're gonna to explore four new tools that's gonna change the way you work. I'm talking about a tool that's gonna to help you get better at sales and this one tool to do all the customer research for you. And for anyone building in the software space, we're gonna go over a new tool, which is like Figma, but way more faster. And we're gonna look at this new AI platform, which is gonna be the hottest product later in the year. Okay, so the first tool is called padboat.com. It is basically your AI sales coach. So this tool is gonna to role play a customer and your goal would be to try to sell it to it. All you have to do is enter your email, you know, like uh jordan belfort like you know sell me a pen kind of thing you can sell anything can sell, sell, anything. sell me this fucking pen right here. and what AI is going to do is going to help you critique your sales pitch it's going to help you understand like you know why you know the customer was not swayed what you can do differently you know how you should actually structure your sales calls i'm just going to call here daniel martin just going to keep it simple and let's see what happens hi who's this hey daniel this is john your buddy marty called uh sh shared your number how's it going hey john i'm doing all right what's this call about buddy told me that you have a big team that you run which is pretty scared of all the AI stuff is that true yeah we have a decent sized team here at skyward solutions advertising is definitely a pain point for us why do you ask totally no it's just that i helped your buddy and their team scale up with their all the AI expertise so like now they're pretty basically producing at 200 percent of the productivity and he said that your team might also be interested i appreciate the offer but i'm not really interested in any new services right now thanks oh. for reaching out oh it's, it's not a service god damn it wow that was rude. But yeah, you know, this is probably what you're gonna hear when you're gonna do any cold call where people are gonna be like super rude and super straightforward. As soon as you're off the phone, it's gonna then critique your calls. It's gonna tell you the filler words you use, the talking speed, your score, and like some more details. So when I did this, my score was like in 20s or 30s, I believe. This time it's a shocker as a zero. I got shut down right away. So that was a bad call at my end. I do need practice here. Give it a shot, try it. If you're in sales or you like, you know, a freelancer, you're running your own business, you're in services, and you have to talk to clients over and over again. Maybe it's gonna help you revise your pitch. Moving on to the next one. This next one is basically already my new favorite tool. So it's called Craftful. And basically this is a tool which is not only gonna analyze all the customer data, but can do user interviews, or like, you know, user surveys automatically with AI. Let me show you why this is so cool. Let's say you have an app, you have a business, you have your reviews anywhere, like, you know, App Store, Google, G2, Trustpilot, whatever you have it. You can just connect that and then you can ask AI to summarize all the customer reviews. You can ask data any question. So I'm gonna create a new account for free we'll have an option to either just paste the text and it's going to analyze that content those reviews or it can connect any sources for the customer data even hubspot fireflies like any customer call i had and all that stuff if you look here on the top it says create a survey this is the fun part click on create a survey and now just type what kind of survey do you want so i have an app called map this which turns pdfs into mind maps and i want to see how people use the app what they think about the quality so i'm just going to say product using quality and since i have no source i'm starting from scratch here i'm just going to pick no source and I'm gonna say create NPS survey. Now he has basically done a pretty good survey here. I mean, I'm not a researcher by experience, but it seems like a survey a researcher would create. The questions and the options are pretty thorough. This is super cool, but we're still not at the coolest part yet. So you can, you know, edit the questions, you can edit the responses, you can delete the questions you don't want. You can share the survey via link or you can embed it on your website. So I'm just gonna create this one for map this. I'm gonna give a custom URL slug and I'm just gonna copy the link. So here's my survey. I'm just gonna go through the answers very quickly. How often do you use the product? What is the primary benefit? benefit you have received from the product yada 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 i've gone through all the questions and now the fun part begins so as soon as i answer all the questions the survey is not done yet so anytime you do a customer interview you do ask them some basic questions and then based on those basic questions you want to ask follow-up questions to really understand what customer wants to say and why they want to say so you can leverage the data to understand what product you need to build where you're going wrong or what else you need to do to better customer experience and make your product or service better and now here it is going to automatically understand the response customer has said and then it's going to ask follow-up questions based on that so here it says uh, you mentioned that the aspect of the product that needs improvement is other could you specify what particular aspects you're referring to and when the user answers that question it's going to ask you another follow-up question but at the same time it's not trying to like really overwhelm the users with any of those information if they don't want to answer user can just finish interview and it'll be done at that stage and all the data is recorded within this platform and on top of that you can just use ai to ask questions like you can just ask hey, hey what bugs did the user mention what is the customer sentiment around, uh, you know, the customer support? Even if you were a software business, you're any business at all, not only you can just support all your customer data and like ask questions and understand about what customers are saying, but you can create these surveys, which is gonna automatically prompt user to share more and more information 
so you can dig deeper without hiring a UX researcher or getting on those calls yourself. So yeah, I'm gonna be implementing this in my application. And then once I have real customer data, I'm gonna, I can probably do another update video to show you the results I got. So yeah, that was Crapful. And now I wanna share you like a tool which is basically like Figma, but so much faster. This tool is called Subframe. So it's basically like a mock-up tool like Figma where you can create high fidelity prototypes or mock-ups right away, except they have a lot of pre-built components. So instead of you starting anything from scratch for basically major components of a website or a web application, needs you have those components pre-built you can just import automatically and then you'll be good to go and of course you can customize it but at least it's a good start to get something going quickly and the code is available for all that stuff so once you log into the application you have an option here for different pages you can go to templates or you have like a bunch of different templates for home dashboard onboarding payments search even marketplace which is like an Airbnb here or if you go to components here you have like a bunch of different components you can track so like you know link button loader navigation dialog drawer alerts and it Thing, anyone any designer like you know is working on a design project all the basic stuff is already here you can either start with a blank page or you can start with an existing template I mean you're using this over Figma so I'm pretty sure you want to start off with a template we're just gonna see here like GPT AI playground you know it kind of looks like open AI here stuff so as soon as you're in the editor you have the template to get started then for all new components you can just basically pick the existing components from the components library and keep adding to your design based on what you want and you can customize this on the right menu over here uh, based on the design theme you're looking for so yeah I want dive into much detail here this basically requires a whole separate video on how to use this tool if you're a figma user and you want to build something quickly maybe give this a shot and see if this is going to help you get to the finish line faster so the next tool is called delphi last year in the summer my team and i were actually building exact same product but our execution was pretty poor we, we basically stopped because we didn't get too far i think uh, we kind of shut down the idea too quickly and i'm glad we did because we would not have been able to compete with this product they're doing an absolutely amazing job if you have all your data let's say you know you are a creator or like you're a public image or you have just all your data like all the content all your thoughts and everything somewhere in a repository either video text whatever you just add all the data to this platform and this platform is going to create your clone that anyone can talk to it's like anyone can access your digital brain without ever talking to you for any information they need and the cool part is that you can actually monetize this if we look at their pricing plan here they say that you can monetize your clone with memberships of course the platform is going to take 20 percent of the commission if you are on the cheaper plan or 15 percent on the on a higher tier plan but basically you can monetize your knowledge so let's say you are a health coach or you're a fitness coach or a business coach you can train all your data all the information that you know the questions people ask you and then you can train this in your bot then you can put the membership so this platform is fairly new the free plan is currently on the wait list so i'm pretty sure that's why a lot of people haven't tried it yet i do not see a reason why it shouldn't be a hot digital product once it's working because you can see all those instagram coaches basically trying to build these uh, bots for themselves so they can monetize more with their audience and help their audience you know engage and get their questions answered right off the bat so over the next few weeks i'm gonna actually build my bot i'm gonna pay for this tool i'm gonna build my bot and uh, i will see if i can monetize it and i'll come back to the channel and show and share my experience here so stay tuned uh, for that video but for now let's see what uh, existing bots they have and how well they work so let's just try Sahil Lavinia here who is the founder of Gumroad and I'm just gonna ask him a quick question here hey, what type of companies would you invest in next so just ask him this question and then here you know the bots typing and it can answer the question and here's the answer I like how engaging this is so it's not just answering the question it's trying to have a conversation so it's asking me a follow-up question as well what factors do you consider when evaluating financial investments in companies and then here I'm just gonna give my answer and now it's gonna give me a follow-up uh, to the response so it's like I'm chatting to Sahil right here. And also like this tool is giving the reference of where the information is being pulled from. So if I just click here on the reference, it's showing me like how like, you know, their content is coming from like different podcasts and different videos that he has done over, over like over the years and how that data is being used to pull that answers in. Four tools we explore today, that's gonna change the way we work. There's one tool to get better at sales. There's one to design things faster. There's one to enter your customers faster. And this one to be the hottest to your product. Let me know in the comments, which company Company you think is going to succeed here and which one's going to fail and if you want more content about new tools and like you know AI and marketing hacks subscribe to the channel i'll see you in the next video